Now, I'm wondering if this device will work on this. Let's check it out and see. Before I share the demo with you, I wanna unbox it. I have not used it. I purchased this product, and this is the Revlon One Step Hair Dryer and Styler. I purchased it from Ulta for about $44. So let's open this up and see what we are working with. All right. I have peeped in the box, but I haven't taken it out to, to actually use it or anything like that. Okay. Okay. So this is the device. It is lightweight. I thought it would be heavier than this. It has the bristles here. And hopefully this will, you know, keep the hair tangle free. And then it has little slits. And I assume where the openings are, y'all see that right in there? That's where the air is going to flow. It has a swivel core, which is good because you have to kind of turn this bad boy around. And it feels really good in my hand. So I think I will be able to work this pretty good. So you can put this on off, cool, low, and high. I guess you do that by turning this little lever here. And this lever lets you know where it is. It's on off here, I'm gonna move it to cool, okay? And you see the little line there? And then I'm gonna move it to high. I don't have it on yet, of course. I'm gonna move it to high. When I use it, I'm gonna start it on, hmm. I guess I'll try low, but then if low doesn't work for me, I'll go to high, okay? so. That's that. Let me turn it off here. And this part here is called the cooling tip. And we can touch and turn here. And it should not be hot here. My hair has been freshly shampooed and conditioned. I have put my leave-in conditioner in and my heat protectant along with it. And I put all the information to what I've used in my hair in the description box. They will be Amazon links, and I am an Amazon associate, so if you decide to order something through my link, do know that I earn a small commission on qualifying links. Okay, so let's get right into this. I have detangled my hair and everything. It says cool, low, and high. I think I'm going to start it on low just to see what I'm working with. First time turning it on. I had it on cool, so I'm going to turn it on low. I was wondering why I didn't feel any heat. <laughs> I need to put it on low. This is cool. This is low. Okay. Look at that. Look at that. My hair, let me turn this off. <laughs> my hair is finer in the back than it is anywhere else on my head, so it is going to probably look straight. And this low is kind of hot, but I'm going to turn it up high in some instances because my hair is wetter than it normally is when I am blow drying it. So let's try this again. I'm going to the low. Low is pretty hot. <laughs> okay, that's cool. Okay. Try this again. Y'all, <laughs> I am about to flat out my hair after I blow dry my hair, and I don't think I'm gonna have to do too much. Yeah, so the heat that I've decided to use with the, the flat iron that I'm using, I think it's going to work. So let me get back to doing this. <laughs> Mm -hmm. 
this is truly a first impression. Y'all, my hair feels so smooth and silky. Oh my goodness. Let me finish this up. I'm just like blown away. Look at that. Look at that. Okay, let's move to the next section. <laughs> I am like blown away and I only use the low, the low setting. Blown away at how my hair actually feels <laughs> and how straight it is now i may not have that same result at, in this part of my head because of the actual texture so let me turn it on low Okay, I think I'm gonna turn this up high and see what I'm working with. Okay, so I'm gonna go high. That was hot. <laughs> Y'all see the smoke? It burnt my hand. So, um, I would start on high, but then I'll just have to work down to low. But anyway, let me try high again just to. The high is really hot, okay? But it got my hair dry pretty fast. So I'm gonna go ahead and work my way through my head. I cannot believe this, y'all see that? Oh my goodness, it's a better blowout than I could do when I did the brushes and the regular handheld blow dryer. So let's do this. Wow, this thing is so neat. It's so neat. And it's, I think I can blow my hair dry pretty fast. <laughs> That high is really hot. <laughs> it's really, really hot. Oh my goodness. <laughs> but it's not really taking me that long to do this. And I didn't time it, but I know it would take me longer to do this, do this with a blow dryer and a brush. So now I'm going to go over this section with the cool shot. I'm going to do my second side of my head and I'll come back and give you my final thoughts on this product. So I'm going to put the cool on to kind of cool this down and then I will do this side and I'll be back. So let me show you how it looks so far. Look at that. Look at that blowout y'all with this device. Oh my goodness. 
Look at that. Okay. Cool. And then I'm going to go and do this side. And I'll come back on camera and give you my final thoughts. Okay guys, this side, I don't know. My texture on one side is loosened and this side is thicker, but anyway. <laughs> um, this is my hair. This is by far, and I'm sweating too, so, you know. I'm sweating on this side and then not so much on this side. But yeah, this is the best blowout that I've done on myself. So, this tool right here is a keeper. I give it a thumbs up for my first impression. Now, let me tell you a little bit about what I thought would happen. I thought these brushes, brush bristles, would be really, really hard, but they are really, really soft and they have give. So I'm like moving my hands over it. I don't know if you guys can see but the bristles are moving. So when I was blow drying my hair with this, my hair was loving this brush and the way it felt on my head because it was so soft, so soft. The only complaint I have about this is that I think it gets a little bit too hot because when I am touching my hair, my hands will burn a little bit. But other than that, this is a pretty good little device here. I like it, I really do. That is my first impression of the Revlon One Step blow dry style or whatever you call it. I really like this. So every time I blow out my hair, um, I'll probably be using this because it did not take me that long. Although I didn't time it, it did not take me that long to do my hair with this device. It was fast, y'all. It's even faster when you have your hair already detangled and with the leave-in and heat protecting all that stuff in it. You can just whiz through your hair in no time. I bet it probably took me about, if I was moving really fast, it probably took me anywhere between 15 to 20 minutes to, to do this. But since I was recording, I had to kind of stop and, and start the camera and all that. But other than that, this is a keeper. If you have tried this device, let me know. If you haven't, would you be willing to try it? I tried it and I like it. I like it, y'all. It got my hair like silky, silky. I'm like, gone with the wind, y'all. Gone with the wind. <laughs> I am very impressed. I was not expecting my hair to look like this. If you want to watch more hair videos, just click the videos on the end screen and I'll see you there. Mm -hmm.